Hello everyone, it's Wonko here, and welcome to another episode in Wonko's Minecraft... Um, what am I saying? Uh, Pist... Oops. Well, we can do without them. Piston and Redstone Creations in Minecraft. Now, this one I'm going to show you today, from a practical standpoint, is absolutely useless, because there are far easier ones to build that work better, look better, and act faster. But... You know, from a s aesthetic standpoint, I kind of like it. So, here it is, a mist style, well, sort of mist style, apart from this top layer, but a mist style uh, hidden bookshelf door in Minecraft. Ta-da! So, if you've never played the video game Mist, there's a library with a bookshelf that withdraws back and turns into stairs, so... This one dropped down, this one drew back and fell down. And that one, I couldn't really make it go too back and drop down, because all of this was in the way. But, so I just made it go up instead, but, you know, it's sort of misty. So, it's the best I've been able to do. So, yeah, I, I like it. I do. It's, and it's two-way, resettable. So, really easy, quite quick too, and it's night time, I don't want it to be night time, sorry about this. So, let's do a quick overview of the redstone. Now, if you've seen my previous videos, you're probably going to know that I am not good at wiring compactly when it comes to redstone. So, that simple mechanism requires all of this. So, let's do a quick breakdown of all of the parts. So, first hit a lever, this turns this. Now, the thing is, okay, let's watch this again. You see how it draws back, and then the pistons that are above here, which, behind here, see them, then they pull it up. Okay, if it happened the... But when it comes down, and I removed the piston there, but when it comes down, it happens in the reverse order. Okay, this drops down and then it gets powered. And that's the same with these ones as well. Now, so it happens in reverse order. So if you power this one, this one first, and that one second on both attempts. With drawing, it would work fine. But when you turned it back on again, this piston and the one that would be there would activate, would push it all out here, then it would be an extended piston and the pistons on top can't extend it down. So it's got to power on one, two, and power off two, one. So there's probably a simpler way of doing it, but this is my machine. So, um, pulse comes in, then it activates this and that. So, this always activates at the same rate, at a constant rate, and then it activates this at the same rate too. So, this comes in, the first thing that happens is this powers, okay? But it doesn't actually power anything. The second thing that happens is this piston pushes up, pushes that piston up to there. Now, that's brought in range of this redstone, and it immediately powers, pushing this block over here. And it um, yeah, gets in the way of this, and it actually transmits a redstone signal right through that block and there. And these two come down. So, in this scenario, uh, this one would go through in three ticks which is the same amount of time there. So this one would pass through, but, and then first, and this one would come second. So let's see that, shall we? Um, right, so, yeah. So we can see that it's, if we watch the outputs there, you can see it over there. The close one went, then the far one. 
and see it alternate. That's because when it powers off, this one, of course, immediately powers off, this one goes after. So, you know. So that's what that does, and this is just all powering the applicable pistons here. So yeah, so that's, this is a really simple design, not sure whether it even deserves a video, but, you know, I like it, because, mainly just because it reminds me of Mist, but I hope you enjoyed this video, comment, rate, subscribe for more, I won't nag you about it, but if you want, anyway, this is Wonko signing out, see you next time.